。喂，咁多位同學，大家好啦，我梁 Sir。今日咧，我哋又嚟做下練習，温下書咯。今日咧，想同大家温嘅咧，就係有關於植物嘅營養需要，同埋啦，不同嘅礦物質啦，喺植物嘅身體入面有啲咩嘅功能啦。題目就問啦，肥料入面咧有唔同類型嘅元素，咁有氮啦，同埋磷嘅化合物嘅。咁呢啲啊，磷同埋氮嘅化合物，俾棵植物係攞嚟製造啲乜嘢呢？咁答案有三個啦，細胞壁啦、葉綠素啦，同埋細胞膜嘅。咁我哋嚟做一擊破咯喎。第一個呢係錯嘅，因為啦，細胞壁呢，實質就由纖維素去構成啦，係咪呢個係植物嘅情況啦？咁啊，纖維素呢嘅單體呢，就係葡萄糖嚟嘅。咁葡萄糖作為碳水化合物當中就淨係得碳啦。氫啦，同埋氧嘅啫，咁就偏偏啊就冇咗磷同埋呢個氮嘅，所以第一個咧就四 goodbye 啦。咁既然一四 goodbye 嘅話咧，其實答案已經呼之欲出，就係二同埋三啦。咁我哋有啲體育精神搞掂埋佢啦。葉綠素咧係正確嘅，因為葉綠素啦，其實就係有碳、氫、氧同埋氮嘅。咁啊，右手邊呢幅圖啦，正正就係一個葉綠素嘅樣啦。咁啊，俾大家見得到啦，佢都有一啲氮嘅元素喺入面嘅。咁所以啦。當中咧，佢係正確嘅。去到第三咯，就係、是、細胞膜啦。其實呢一 part 咧，就係考下大家有關於細胞膜嘅結構嘅。細胞膜除咗有蛋白質嘅分子，亦都有磷脂嘅分子。磷脂相層啊嘛，係咪？咁蛋白質啦，咪有氮咯。磷脂相層啦，咁咪有磷咯。咁所以啦，第三。細胞膜都係正確嘅，咁啲答案就係 C 啦。咁其實過往啦都有一條咧好類近嘅題目嘅，已經係講緊二零一二年啦。咁其實嗰條咧就係考翻大家啦，植物進行光合作用去產生葡萄糖，咁葡萄糖可以攞嚟做乜嘢咧？咁有第一啦，纖維素啦，第二啦，蛋白質啦，同埋呢個。澱粉質嘅答案咧就係 D 嚟嘅，咁其實啦都係考緊大家咧一啲物質之間嘅轉換。Hello student, I'm Mr. Lang. So in this video, let's do the revision about the plants topics. So let's recall the nutritional needs of the plants and the function of the various types of minerals in the plants. So in this question, it's asking that fertilizer usually contains nitrogen and phosphorus compound. So they are used by the plants for synthesis of cell wall. Chlorophyll and cell membrane. So let's take a look at the answer one by one. First answer is wrong because cell wall is made up of cellulose, and the cellulose is made up of many glucose molecules. So for the glucose molecules, they are carbohydrates. So it consists of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So you can see that there is no nitrogen and phosphate. So number one. Eliminate. So we can see that say goodbye to option one, and then we got the final answer should be option C. Why are chlorophyll and cell membranes their correct answer? For the chlorophyll, it contains carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen, and you can refer to the structure of the chlorophyll molecules. So you can see that it contains the nitrogen atom. So it is the answer, and then for the Number three, cell membrane. Actually, this question is checking us the concept about the cell membrane. The cell membrane is made up of protein molecules and the phospholipid molecules. So in the protein molecules, we can find the nitrogen, and in the phospholipid molecule, we can find the phosphate group. Therefore, option three is also correct. So the answer is C. And you can find that for the two one two MC is asking the very similar question. Plants carry out photosynthesis to produce glucose, which is required for the formation of cellulose. Surely, is correct. We use the carbohydrate to make up the cell wall, and the plant also use the carbohydrates as the skeleton with the minerals, which is the nitrate. Uh, we can add it to the soil as the fertilizer, and then the plant absorb the nitrate with the carbon skeleton, produce the protein. And also for the starch, the plant can store the carbohydrate in the form of the starch. Therefore, the answer is D. So you can see that the conversion of different substance molecules in the plant's body.